the idea of wanting to recreate anything iconic, so especially that so iconic, uh, you know, there's definitely trepidation that goes along with that. Um, but then once I knew that, well, Steven, of course, and Tony Kushner were behind it, it was, it's, it's only set up for success, I think, you know. And, and you know, and the whole point is not to, not to replace what is already perfection in a way, you know, but instead build upon it and, and continue to tell that story because it is so important. It's American history. Griff is uh, someone of Tony's past that has really provided a certain coping and love that sustained Tony for a certain amount of time and has, you know, helped him until it no longer served him. And, uh, you know, we really see, I think, where we are in this, uh, where this movie takes place is that relationship really putting, being put to the test and, and seeing Tony choosing to, uh, you know, relinquish that friendship in a way. And Riff really uh, trying to hold on as much as possible. The Jets have been on the brink of losing each other. And so they've done everything in their power to try to just hold on to each other, which is their family, the only thing that they really do know. And the nearest outlet and energy for them uh, happens to be the Sharks, you know, this group of uh, minorities that move in and uh, are growing in, popula in population and kind of what the Jets perceive as taking over. And it's a, it's a real outlet for these guys to um, bond in a, in a common a enemy, you know? And it's, it's, not, it's not for the better, but it's really the only way that the Jets uh, kind of see for, to hold on to one another. Steven's fascinating in, in the sense of, like, here's a guy who literally has everything. Right, you know, and um, if you take, if you, if you were to take away the past movies that he has done, the accolades, the money, the, I don't know, everything that went along with the identification of who Steven Spielberg was, um, what I witnessed and saw was uh, <laughs> a person who is just chasing his joy every day. Every day he'd show up to set and just chase his joy.